Good morning, I am headed off to work. It's Monday morning and I think I'm gonna stop at Panera. It's 8.05 right now and I don't have to be at work until nine and usually with the traffic, I try to leave right at eight, but usually I end up leaving at like 8.15. So I think if I leave now, I'll have time to stop and grab a coffee before heading in. I already had coffee this morning, but it's definitely a two coffee morning and that is the plan. I'm really excited for this week because it's my best friend's birthday. And she is having her birthday party at the country dancing bar that we always go to. And we got a bunch of stuff for it. The theme is disco cowgirl. And I'm really excited to show you all that stuff. And then tomorrow's kind of weird. Her birthday, we're celebrating on Thursday, but her birthday is actually Friday. But then tomorrow I also was summoned for jury duty. So I'm doing that this week. So I'm going to work today, jury duty tomorrow, Wednesday work, Thursday I have off and I am getting all of her stuff ready for the party. We're going to surprise her and she pretty much already knows about everything, but we're going to surprise her and set everything up at the table. And then pretty much that's it. I have to get all the balloons blown up and everything like that. And so now I'm going to head over to work. Good morning! Today is Michaela's birthday and I have a lot to do today. I'm gonna get ready now and then I'm gonna clean my apartment before I head out and then I need to stop by Safeway or somewhere that can blow up all of her balloons. So I may stop by either just Goodwill to find like a cheap fun top or maybe a store, I'm not really sure, but I'm gonna try to figure out what I wanna wear tonight and then I need to practice the dance that we're doing because every time someone has a birthday at the country dancing bar we go to, we can request a song. They picked one out. We have mostly learned all of it. I think they pretty much learned all of it. And I've learned all the steps. I just need to learn it at full speed, basically. So that's the plan for today. I am going to finish getting ready. I washed my hair this morning too, so it's still a little bit damp. So I'm going to put it out of my face. Let it air dry a little bit while I do my makeup. Never broke a bone, so Okay, I just cleaned the kitchen and I'm about to head to Fred Meyer to get her balloons blown up and then pick up the last few birthday things I need. And I wanted to show you what I have so far. First, just this little pack of happy birthday balloons, some disco ball plates. This is the tablecloth. It's just white with kind of like little glittery dots and then it has a little table runner. Then I got two packs of confetti to go over the table. The first one is just some silver glitter, fun, sparkles. And then this one is really cute. It has little disco balls and little cowboy hats. A pack of hot pink glow sticks that I'm gonna have out on the table for people to grab. And then also these little 
party hats because the colors I don't know if I mentioned this before but the color theme is disco cowgirl with silver white and black and hot pink is the only color color so I just realized I left the balloons that I'm filling upstairs so I will be right back and then I also packed in the trunk my donations to Goodwill that I'm going to drop off. And then if I don't find anything to wear in Fred Meyer, then I might stop at Goodwill to try to find a cute top or something. The balloons are secured. Well, secured is a strong word, but they're here. And they're really cool, I'm really excited. I'm going to really quickly eat some sushi that I bought at Fred Meyer for lunch, and then stop at Goodwill. It's three o'clock now, and I'm supposed to be at the bar by five, so we are definitely running a little bit behind schedule. Okay, so I got back from the grocery store and I did stop at Goodwill and the last few things I need to do before I'm ready to go are do my hair. I have some sparkly silver makeup that I'm going to put on. I don't know, I'll probably do something like in the corner of my eye, maybe like highlighter, just something kind of fun with it. And then I got some press on nails that I'm going to put on and I got her little gift that I'm going to put together. So of course we got the hot pink bag to go with the theme. Then the main present that I got her is this little cowboy boot, ceramic cowboy boot. They're kind of popular, so I feel like you may have seen them, but you put matches in the middle and then you strike them on the bottom of the shoe. And so I got some green matches, which is really nice because her house colors are kind of like earthy tones. And so this will be really cute. It'll like go with her house. She just bought a new house too, which is really nice. And then I got a candle to go with it so she can put it next to it and use it. Then she also just got a little kitty cat and it's orange and I found this mug that says cat mama with a little orange cute cat so it was perfect and the last thing I got her are two packages of smart sweets and her favorite candies because she tries not to eat very much sugar so that's her little birthday gift and I'm gonna put that together right up the card then I'm gonna do Probably I'll do my hair first before I do my nails, just because I feel like the nails are like the last thing that I should do. But it's almost 4.30. I was supposed to be there at five. She's not gonna be there. She doesn't even get off work until six, but we like to snag a table early. Pretty much as soon as I get all this done is what I'm gonna leave. So let's get started.
Okay, so I just pulled up to work and I only have a couple minutes before I need to go inside, but I wanted to update you guys since Thursday. It was super fun. Everything worked out exactly as we planned and Michaela had a blast. So she's now at the beach celebrating the rest of her birthday weekend with her husband and I will see her again on Monday. Today is Saturday. I work today and then tomorrow I'm going to try to go to church and just kind of get ready for the week, do some chores and errands and stuff like that. But for now, I'm heading in to work and I got, I stopped and got my favorite drink. It is a iced oat milk latte with an extra shot and soft top from Dutch Bros. It's so yummy and it's not super bad for you because it doesn't have a ton of sugar, but it has just enough that it tastes pretty good still. And I definitely need it because I am very tired from this weekend, but I'm very glad that I had yesterday off to recover from Thursday. But anyways, let's get to work. So I am home from work and I just feel really stagnant. So I have been thinking about rearranging the furniture in my room for a little while, but there's really not a ton that I can do with it because the wall behind me has two big mirror doors to my closet and then right next to that is my vanity and then right next to that is the door so that wall is completely unmovable and the only other thing that i could do would be move my bed on this side of the room but i don't really like it being right in front of the door that just doesn't vibe very well for me so basically this is where the head of the bed is right now and i'm going to put it over here and then the nightstand will go next to it there and I need to clean my room too. I have been really behind on all the stuffs. And then this is Mr. Sonny, and he is very sad because his sister, or my sister, his mom, is out gallivanting. And he doesn't know when she's coming back, and it bothers him. Yeah. So anyway, let's get this crackhead energy started. But first, I wanna show you the sweatshirt. It's Honestly, my favorite thing ever. I got it in like either an XL or a double XL, and it's from Lexi Hidalgo's Moments podcast merch. And it says "Live in the Moment" on the front, and then on the back it says "I am a human being and not a human doing." And I love that quote. And it's my emotional support sweater. So, yeah. Took out this measuring tape and measured the distance of the bed this way. So that way, I, whenever I move it, I know about how much floor space I'll get. Because part of the reason I wanted to do this too was it would give me a lot more floor space so I could practice line dancing in here because the living room doesn't have air conditioning, but my room does, so I can just do it whenever I want, which will be really nice. This bed is extremely heavy too, so I don't really know what I'm doing. And honestly, this is probably a bad idea, but I've never felt more alive, so... Take a look out the window Spirit goes up as the rain falls down I've been sitting on the wrong course Keeping it together like I did before Think that I've said this a few times Even with that, has it ever felt right? I swear that this has happened every moment Can I just be honest? I was only wondering all the nightstand cords in before I push this against the wall. This was a little wild, a little chaotic. Sunny's confused. I'm confused. We're all a bit confused. Yay, I did it. And what's really nice is because of this little section of the headboard, it leaves a gap. So it'll still be pretty easy to make the bed. Yay. Space, cause I wanna believe that Ooh, I get lost, you go with your day Slow, I can't 
Closer, but you're more in a way I know it's just a recap But I'm sure you'll never see that I'd rather take it all back Maybe it's time to get home Think that it's going a little too far Even after all the white noise Oh, I still wanted to restart Give all you take in my time Feels like I'm patiently waiting in line So can we ever have another moment? Can you just be honest? I was only wondering if maybe we can take it to a different conversation Things are getting comfortable, but only if we make it I just want to say Okay, so I made my bed up enough for me to go to sleep on it And I think... I'm going to tackle this big pile of laundry and junk to put away tomorrow and for now I'm going to go shower. So I just got back from church and I just had some breakfast and the last thing I'm going to do for this week is get my room organized and so I have a pile of laundry to fold and then just some tidying up and that's pretty much it. So I'm going to make the bed, fold and put away all this laundry that's clean and then just put everything else away that needs to be. It looks like a lot more work than it probably is going to be just because most of it is literally just clothes that I need to fold. So I feel like it will not be too bad of a process. And then I'll probably also just clean up my vanity too. Okay, I think that's where I'm going to end off the vlog for this week. I finished doing all of my to-do list and I think I'm just going to spend the rest of the Sunday relaxing and enjoying the day. So I will see you next week. Bye. I'd hope that you would see